Hi guys, welcome back. So today we're going to be doing a live swatch of the full Zoya Splash Collection for summer 2020. We have 12 new nail polishes in this Splash Collection. We have a number of vibrant hued creams. We have some shimmers. We have some really, really gorgeous finishes. There's one topper. So I can't wait to get into this video. These polishes launch on May 15th at Zoya.com. The link for the website will be down in the description bar below if you'd like to go check it out. I'm going to be doing two coats of everything today on my natural nails so you can see how they perform for me. Hint, they perform really great. And then I will give you my full hand swatch, either two or three coats of everything today with top coat and macro shots of the items that benefit from those macro shots. So let's go ahead and start swatching on my lips today. I have this juicy lip gloss from the brand Tower 28 and this is in the shade XOXO. The wind just really started to pick up outside my window so if you hear any loud noises, it's getting pretty windy tonight. Okay, so the first polish up, we're going in alphabetical order, is this beautiful red jelly just absolutely packed with this gold shimmer, making for quite an impact on the nail. This almost looks like a metallic red with gold shimmer. That's how much they packed in here. It's just beautiful. This polish is called Seely, C-E-L-I. And this happens to be one of my favorites, actually, the two polishes in the collection that have this formulation are some of my very favorites. They just make a really awesome impact on the nail. They feel very summer to me, so I really, really enjoyed this one. So this is Sealy. We're doing two coats, and it just has a gorgeous combination of that red with the very strong gold. And if you like that look, there's a pink with that very strong gold coming up later on at the very tail of the collection. So next up, we're gonna look at the first of a couple polishes that have this like dusty curly formula with a very strong shimmer. And it's kind of like a soft gold um, to silver kind of shimmer, but it's very, very strong. These polishes are on the sheerer side. So I'm gonna show you two coats. You might find you have a better effect with these polishes if you do three thin coats so that you don't overload your nail as it tries to settle down onto your nail after you paint it on. So that was my experience with the polish. The first one is called Corina, and this one is the soft blushy mauve kind of shade. It's like a grayed out blush mauve. It's really, really pretty. So next up we have the topper, and this polish has a similar shimmer to what we just looked at. It's kind of like icy bluey silver kind of shimmer. This is called Eclipse, by the way. And then it is filled with all these iridescent glitters. They're not too large and they're not like incredibly small, just kind of right there in that perfect range to give you a very delicate but still sparkling look on the nail. You can really see this polish. You don't need more than one coat to give you a nice topped uh, like frosted look. This gives you kind of like a sea froth look on the nail. It's really beautiful. And the iridescent glitters, I'm getting a lot of blue and green, a little bit of gold. So this is Eclipse. I don't think that I would try to wear this as a standalone polish. It's definitely a topper. Okay, so next up we're gonna look at one of the creams in the collection. This is the first cream so far, and this is called Emma. And this is a beautiful peachy coral shade. Great at two coats. Depending on your application, you could maybe go for a third coat if you find that you have a little bit of streakiness. But what a beautiful shade. It's definitely a cool toned peachy coral, just lovely. A very beautiful, like blush shade too. Super, super pretty. Gorgeous for summer, very refreshing. So this is Emma, and I just did two coats today for my application. The next polish we're gonna look at has the same formulation as that blush. So it has a very strong golden hue, and then it has like, um, like an icy blue kind of shift on it as well. This one's called Fisher, and this time instead of a dusty, rosy mauve, we have this dusty sea blue green kind of shade. And again, if this have the same formula, you're gonna wanna do probably three thin coats. You're watching me swatch it at two coats. This is my first impression swatch that you always see me do on my channel. And so I went in with like two coats, the same that I would with their creams, but of course it's not the same formula. So you make a slight adjustment and then I figured out which way I wanted to go with for these polishes. So for the final look, 
I did three thin coats. Next up, we have the red cream in the collection and Zoya red creams are kind of just like a standard, which means that it has a fantastic formulation. You only really need one coat on this polish. It is called Greta. It's not like a very um, severe red. It's very classic looking, but still youthful. So I enjoy this one quite a bit, very easy to use. So that's Greta, beautiful at just uh, one coat really, but I'm showing you two for my swatches. The next polish is called Harbor. And this is just a beautiful, intensely bright turquoise, like turquoise to teal shade. Turquoise is a little too tame for this color. It's, it's like a bright aqua teal, so, so pretty. This is a very, very pigmented polish. I definitely recommend base coat with this polish and it's giving you fantastic pigmentation in just the two coats. What a beautiful shade. Oh my gosh, I could see myself having this on my toes all summer long. Just beautiful, um, highly, highly pigmented polish. That's Harbor. Next up we have the purple and this is kind of like a deep, um, grapey shade, just like a really nice violet purple. And this one's called Jessica, Jessica with a C. And this has the same uh, formulation as that red, just gorgeous in just one coat, really, really easy to use. Just smooth, buttery application. I'm gonna show you two for consistency sake, but wow, this is just so beautiful. And I'm so happy to have another Zoya Purple. I collect them and I have a great many of them and they're all fantastic and individual and I really, really love that shade, Jessica. Next up, we have this pink that is very purpley pink. It's a very, very light kind of orchid pink. This is called Jody. And this is really lovely, very white bright kind of purpley pink. And it gets nice and opaque at two coats. It's gonna give you a really fresh look on the nail. Again, a great toe shade. I really love this shade. There's so much purple in it. If you're gonna do a light pink, this kind of color is what I want because there's so, so, so much purple in it. So this is Jody. I did two coats for this one. I was really pleased with the pigmentation on that one after two coats and I got a streak-free manicure in the two coats. Next up, we have the polish that's been on my thumb for the swatching of this video and this is the beautiful saturated medium kind of berry pink. It's not too blue toned. Um, this one's called Christy. Christy with an IE on the end. And just again, beautiful one coat pigmentation. So, so easy to use. Stellar look on the nail. Actually, my thumb nail that you are watching when I'm showing bottle shots and, and things did not have top coat on it. It's a very glossy cream formula. Really, really lovely. So this is Christy. Incredibly easy to use the creams in this collection. Next up, we have that color of Christy, but in the same formula as that first red. Pack full of that beautiful gold shimmer and this is another one of my favorites out of the collection it's stunning it's also called leilani which is one of my best friends names and so i'm so happy that she has a polish um name for her that she can wear that is so gorgeous um so it's just very very densely packed with this gold shimmer and beautiful at two coats just stunning so this is another one of my top picks out of the collection that's leilani and I'm getting two coat coverage there for you, I'll give you a macro shot of all those beautiful micro flaky shimmers. So, so pretty. The final polish in the collection is a nice deep ultramarine blue. Uh, this is called Marin, and it's just like a kind of true blue, like Grecian blue, so gorgeous. Definitely makes me think of summer. Beautiful, easy application. I did two coats on this one rather than the one, uh, but really, really easy to apply. And I didn't have staining issues with this one, so that was really nice. This is Marin and my full hand swatcher scene. Two coats for that one. So I hope that you found something in here that you like for summer 2020. There's so much to play with. A lot of great shimmering things, kind of evoking the look of the water and you know the shimmering sun off the water. If you were happen to be on vacation in Greece right now, that would be fantastic. Um, but in any case, these polishes can make you feel like you're splashing around in the waves. And I found them to be very dazzling, beautiful shades and the creams super, super easy to use. So this is a splash collection from Zoya for summer 2020. They launch on May 15th, like I said. The description bar down below has the link for you to the website if you'd like to shop 
And if I hear of any codes or anything like that, I'll put that down in the description bar as well for you. So that's going to be it for this video. If you aren't yet subscribed to my channel, I encourage you to do so. Join our little family here, and if you hit the notification bell, you will find out whenever I put up a new video. Specifically, if you want to find out about all the lives that we do, or we have live giveaways and fun things like that. So anyway, we hope that you join us. I'll see you back for another video very soon. Take care until then. Bye!